Hello, friend Mormo here. It's a gloomy day. I'm just at Dollar Tree. As you can see, I'm gonna pick up some White Castle cheeseburger bites from dinner and maybe some other snacks. But it's a gloomy day here in Missouri. There's like a extreme weather warning for tonight. There's going to be thunderstorms, possible tornadoes. So keep watching, keep watching. Okay, friends, so I got done shopping. It was a really quick trip. I bought this. I don't know if I'm going to eat it right now or if I'll do a review later, but it's a gummy snack pack and it has mac and cheese gummies. Oscar Mayer hot dog gummies and Clausen pickle gummies. I think I'll probably do a review of this later. But it should be fun for sure. And then I got some energy drinks. This is my favorite energy drink right now. It's called Big Game Energy and uh, Sour Gummy. And it's my favorite energy drink on the market right now. Sugar free, zero sugar. but I definitely need a buzz. I started taking Ativan again to deal with my mania and hallucinations and stuff. And I'd stopped taking it because it's supposed to be very addictive. But I just needed something to help with the hallucinations and mania. So I started taking Ativan again, and it really knocks my ass out big time. And, uh, woke up today feeling like hungover and just super tired and low energy. So that's why I wanted to pick up an energy drink. I still need to go to Spirit Shop today so my chores aren't over yet. I also got these, I don't know if they'll be good or not, but I got these nacho cheese bugles. I just decided to give them a try, see if I like them, but yeah, I'm hoping that it doesn't storm too bad tonight. Hopefully there's no tornado. I saw on the news there was tornadoes all over the Midwest and they're saying tonight at like 11 o'clock it's going to storm here and it could tornado. So fingers crossed that doesn't happen. And uh, I got quite a bit of art cards on eBay right now. They're all discounted. I reduced the prices, except for the Walnut Witch cards, because the Walnut Witch cards were a whole Sega. Some, like Chris Dreyer, could probably make a feature length documentary about those Walnut Witch cards. And uh, so I'm not going to lower the price on those. They're, I think right now they're at 40 a piece, but I think most every other card I've reduced to 15 a piece. So there's some good deals and then next month I'll um, make another print that I can give out. But I do have some extra prints. If anybody orders a card, I always throw in bonuses. And I'm mostly looking for new buyers. If you already have a collection, then don't stress. But if you haven't bought a card yet, I recommend you do because it's really, it's different seeing them online and holding them in your hand. There's a big difference.
and I think they're an opportunity, a good investment that you could buy now for 15 and then flip for 30 or 40 down the road. Eventually I'll get on Daily Show or some national news show and then the value of my art will go up and people can flip my cards and make money off of them. But yeah, I just kind of sleepy today. Like I say, that out of van just kicks my ass. But it's better to be sleepy than to be manic or hallucinating or whatever. Anyways, keep watching. I'm going to go to Spirit Shop next, so keep watching. Hello, friend. I'm here at Spirit Shop. I always park facing the highway. It's a little easier to get in and out that way. And I like to watch the cars go by and everything. It's so embarrassing, but I have to pay for a lighter. Cause last time I was at Spirit Shop, I spurred out and said I didn't get a lighter that I paid for. So they gave me another one. And then I found the lighter that I originally got, so now I have to pay them back for that lighter. So keep watching. Okay, friends, so I paid for the lighter. What happened, it's such a dumb story, is that I bought a couple cartons this month and a lighter, and then I got to my car and I couldn't find the lighter. So I went back in and complained and say I never got the lighter so he gave me a replacement and then later that day I found the lighter so it was just me spurging out and being dumb and so I paid for a lighter and put it back today just trying to be honest and everything. I always try and be honest and the people at Spirit Shop are good people I don't want to rip them off and uh, so but yeah I was able to get a carton today because of art card sales so it's real lucky month and uh, I'd like to get a couple more art card sales. Like I say, I lowered my prices a lot recently. I think most of my cards are 15 right now. And uh, so check out my eBay store. I'll put a link in the description. You can pick up some cards. If you've never picked up cards before, I recommend you do it. Especially at this discounted price I have them at. They're pretty cheap right now and you always get extras and stuff every time you buy from me. I throw in extras, stickers, and signed photos and stuff. And uh, just ready to go home and have my White Castle Bites. And I may do a live stream. I know Grady told me he thought I'd make more money if I started doing more live streams. So I may start doing live streams more often, like every day or something. I'm wearing my sweater, but I'm actually getting very hot and sweating right now. I probably should have taken a shower before I went out in the public, but I didn't feel like it today. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. Sorry, this was a pretty boring video. I just 
another trip to Dollar Tree and Spirit Shop. I've made so many of these videos already. And just drinking a big game energy sour gummy. Nothing really new to show you today. Just same old, same old stuff. But uh, I did get some Fago. I got a four pack of Fago grape. So I might do a Juggalo live stream drinking my Fago. And thanks so much. And like I say, check out my eBay store. I'll put a link in the description. And thanks so much. Hello, friend. I'm back with an update. I'm so stoked. Just as I pulled into my house, uh, my phone chirped. It was an eBay chirp. And somebody offered me $10 for one of my cards. That's the thing about eBay is if you don't like the price, you can make an offer and, uh, and make a different offer. And um, so somebody offered me 10 bucks for a $15 card and I took the offer. So somebody's getting a card for 10 bucks. And I don't know if they're a fan or just a, a um, Sailor Moon fan or what, but I decided to give them an autographed uh, photo just in case they're a fan of my show. So I'm going to put the autographed photo in the letter. And then I got their thank you card all printed out. And this is the card they bought, the um, Sailor Moon uh, figure drawing card. This is the first figure drawing to sell. So I'm real stoked about that. So I'm going to put that in the card. And then I'm going to give him two um, Walnut Witch prints as a um, bonus. And I'll include a Swin Dispensary sticker as a bonus. So he's getting all kinds of bonuses for his 10 bucks. And um, it's really good. When I get sales, I also get exercise because then I have to walk up to the mailbox. So it's I get money and I get exercise when somebody buys. Hold on a second. I don't know how to do this. but it's really good when people buy my cards. And uh, let me throw a piece of tape on here. Well, anyways, that's it. I got a sale. Just know that you can make me an offer and pay less than what I ask for. And more often than not, I'll accept the offer. And uh, on eBay, and thanks so much for watching. Have a great night.